Hey, Captain Phil here. Uh, just going through some tackle trays and uh, rigging the boat. Uh, but I just wanted to talk about uh, an often overlooked uh, spring musky bait, early season musky bait. Um, and that is what we would call a slash bait. The, uh, the classic slash bait is the X wrap, a uh, little on the small side. I love these things for pike and bass and really they catch everything and they do catch muskies but uh, if you're going for something a little bit bigger look which we often do uh, it's great bait great action one of the classic lures uh, that's overlooked that i've been using for a long long time is the magnum bomber longy and it's basically i call it the og uh, slash bait as you can see it's got the small really small round lip on it and what that does is it doesn't have a lot of water resistance and so when you twitch it erratically it really darts and slashes in the water um, we really like uh, these kind of crankbaits for twitching uh, like a grandma or a jake or this storm flat stick uh, they move a ton of water and uh, we grind them into the rocks and weeds in the summertime when the water's hot. And, uh, but that's, uh, that's, that's a topic for a different day, a uh, different tool entirely. Uh, these, these little slash baits, a lot, of, a lot of musky guys are probably turned off. Uh, a, they're not quite as big or uh, sexy looking as a lot of the, the musky baits on the market. And they're only about 10 bucks. So... Um, that turns a lot of people off right away, the fact that they're only $10, but um, you can carry a whole box of them. And what I do is I upgrade the hooks. Uh, it adds a little bit of weight, and these are 4X, 4 odd hooks, and so uh, it gives it a little bit less buoyancy even, uh, so it can really, they really zing in the water. One of the enemies of, uh, of something's ability to glide or slash uh, well, one is buoyancy. If it pops up like a cork, it's, it's not going to glide or slash very well. Number two, large lip baits just don't glide or slash very well uh, because there's too much water resistance. So these thin profile minnow baits with a small round lip and little water resistance, you can work them really, really erratically. And it, you can trigger muskies uh, that are pretty lethargic. You can trigger an instinct in them. Uh, to attack the bait and uh, get them fired up and they nail them and so over the years yeah I put some feathers and some flashaboo on a few of them uh, just for confidence I don't know if it makes a huge difference but I'm basically mimicking that uh, X wrap but in, when they want a small really small lure yeah you, uh, an X wrap is a good one to go to if you want to size up Try the, uh, the Bomber Magnum Long A's, the classics. Take her around with colors. Uh, up, so upgrade the hooks. And uh, it's probably my all-time pr producer for muskies in June here in Minnesota. So hope you'd like the tip. And uh, cheers and hook sets.